ever heard of the bionic woman? No? Well, buckle up for a blast from the past. This 1976 TV series follows the extraordinary life of Jamie Somers, a woman with bionic enhancements that give her superhuman abilities. No capes, just bionics. Now, here's the kicker. There are some jaw-dropping, laugh-out-loud, and tear-jerking moments waiting for you in this classic show. Curious, huh? Keep watching, and you'll stumble upon scenes that'll make you question, did that just happen? Trust us, it's a roller coaster of emotions. Quick question, is there a specific scene or moment in the bionic woman that left a lasting mark on you? Maybe a moment that made you a lifelong fan? Or perhaps, when was the first time you tuned in to catch Jamie Somers in action? Memories like these are timeless, and we'd love to hear your stories. Share your most cherished experience or memory related to the show in the comments below. Your nostalgia is our treasure trove. So, don't be shy, spill the bionic beans. Your tales could be the missing link in someone else's journey down memory lane. Keep the conversation alive, and let's relive those bionic moments together. And remember, there's more to come, so stay tuned for the funny, shocking, and sad facts that await. This journey down memory lane is just getting started. The Bionic Woman, a groundbreaking TV series from 1976, left an indelible mark on popular culture. Chronicling the extraordinary life of Jamie Somers with her bionic enhancements, the show garnered widespread acclaim during its time. Its impact was not confined to the small screen as it sparked a cultural phenomenon. The reception was nothing short of phenomenal. Audiences were captivated by the unique narrative and the superhuman abilities of Jamie Somers. The absence of traditional superhero tropes, such as capes, added a refreshing twist to the storytelling. Viewers found themselves on a roller coaster of emotions, oscillating between jaw-dropping, laugh-out-loud, and tear-jerking moments. The influence of the show transcended the TV screen, giving rise to a wave of spin-offs, merchandise, and adaptations. Jamie Somers became a cultural icon, and her bionic adventures inspired a new wave of storytelling in various forms. The impact wasn't just confined to the 1970s, it endured over the years, creating a lasting legacy in the annals of television history. Spin-offs and adaptations fueled the fervor surrounding the series. The character's popularity spawned a range of merchandise, from action figures to novels, further embedding Jamie Somers into the fabric of popular culture. The legacy was solidified, resonating with fans across generations. As the bionic fever continued, the show became a touchstone for nostalgia. Fans fondly reminisced about specific scenes or moments that left a lasting impression. Its ability to evoke timeless memories became a treasure trove for enthusiasts, connecting them through shared experiences. In retrospect, the bionic woman stands as a testament to the power of innovative storytelling and character development. Its impact on popular culture, evident in the array of spin-offs and merchandise, underscores the enduring appeal of Jamie Somers' bionic saga. The series' legacy continues to echo in the hearts of fans who cherish the timeless moments it provided. Amidst the captivating narrative of the bionic woman in 1976, the backstage stories unveil a realm of intriguing happenings that added layers to the show's allure. Behind the scenes, the cast and crew navigated the challenges of bringing Jamie Somers' bionic adventures to life, creating an atmosphere brimming with creativity and unforeseen moments. One particular anecdote involves a behind-the-camera mishap during the filming of a high-stakes action sequence. In a moment intended to be a seamless display of Jamie's bionic prowess, the wires supporting a stunt double unexpectedly snapped, causing a comical yet unexpected twist to the scene. The cast, initially poised for a gravity-defying leap, found themselves in a collective burst of laughter as the unplanned mishap unfolded. The director, quick on their feet, decided to keep the candid blooper, turning an accident into a memorable and endearing moment for both the crew and future viewers. On another occasion, the chemistry between the lead actors sparked an unscripted moment that left an indelible mark on the set. In the midst of a tense scene, a spontaneous burst of laughter erupted between takes, breaking the tension and fostering a camaraderie that translated seamlessly onto the screen. This unplanned camaraderie became a recurring theme, adding a layer of authenticity to the on-screen relationships that resonated with the audience. Furthermore, the creation of Jamie Somers' iconic bionic sound effects involved a behind-the-scenes collaboration that deserves recognition. 
Sound designers experimented with various electronic tones and mechanical noises, ultimately blending them into the distinctive sound that accompanied Jamie's every bionic move. The meticulous attention to detail in crafting these audio signatures became a testament to the dedication of the production team, enhancing the overall viewing experience. As the series unfolded, the unpredictability of live productions led to numerous memorable behind-the-scenes anecdotes, weaving an intricate tapestry of laughter, camaraderie, and creative problem-solving. These stories, while not always visible on screen, contributed to the multifaceted charm that made the Bionic Woman a timeless classic. Maximilian, the bionic dog in the third season, earned his name because it cost a whopping one million to bring him to life. This hefty price tag marked him as a testament to the show's commitment to cutting-edge technology. During its final season, the bionic woman underwent a network shift from ABC to NBC. Richard Anderson and Martin E. Brooks achieved a unique milestone by becoming the first actors to portray the same characters on two distinct television series airing on different networks. Their continued appearances in The Six Million Dollar Man, which stayed on ABC, etched their names in television history. The inspiration behind Jamie Somber's name came from real life. Kenneth Johnson, the producer, drew from his experience working with killer whale shows at SeaWorld. He collaborated with a water skier named Jamie Summers, and her name became the perfect fit for the bionic character. Johnson noted that the real Jamie expressed delight in having her name associated with the iconic character. The behind-the-scenes stories of the bionic woman added depth to its allure. In one incident, a mishap during a high-stakes action sequence turned into a comical blooper, creating an unexpected moment of humor for both the crew and viewers. Another unscripted laughter between lead actors, breaking tension during a scene, fostered an authentic camaraderie that translated onto the screen. The creation of Jamie Somers' bionic sound effects involved meticulous collaboration among the production team. Sound designers experimented with electronic tones and mechanical noises, crafting the distinctive sounds accompanying Jamie's every move. This attention to detail enhanced the overall viewing experience, showcasing the dedication behind the scenes. The journey through the bionic woman, marked by technological marvels, network shifts, and real-life inspirations, offers a unique glimpse into the world that captivated audiences in 1976. These facets, whether planned or spontaneous, contribute to the show's timeless legacy. Lindsay Wagner took the lead in the Bionic Wedding TV movie reunion, despite Lee Majors finding success in the 80s with The Fall Guy. Wagner, however, did not experience a similar post-Bionic franchise hit. In the first year of The Bionic Woman, a car accident involving Lindsay Wagner and her then-boyfriend, actor Michael Brandon, interrupted production for two weeks. Wagner sustained a cut on her upper lip, leaving a permanent scar. The accident necessitated a hiatus to allow her time to recover. Jamie Somers and Steve were portrayed as high school sweethearts, yet in reality, Lee Majors was a decade older than Lindsay Wagner.